Welcome to the Old Timer Centre. My name is Philip Tarrant, and today we have for you a 1996 Mercedes Benz E36 AMG. And this is a car we have sold before and we are very familiar with. The E36 is a very rare car indeed. There is about 40 bought into the country and they're very hard to find. They are one of the very first AMGs available in Australia from factory along with the C36 AMG. It's got a 3.6 litre straight six engine and it sounds absolutely fantastic. It redlines at six and a half thousand RPM. Uh, this particular car has done 145,000 kilometers and it's got an incredible service history to it and is in impeccable condition. It's got a very nice set of Pirelli tires and the E36 we think is one day to be a collector's item just because of the rarity of them obviously they were one of the last of the six cylinder AMGs it's even got these special number plates which do come with the car 36 AMG it's silver with charcoal interior and I think is one of the best colour combinations they're also available in a very dark green colour and burgundy but I think silver is the cleanest, best looking colour you can get in this series. The car has incredible power. It's got a four speed gearbox, but it's not, it's not the same gearbox taken out of an E240 or an E320. It's got a lock up torque converter and is built to handle the additional power. The good thing about an AMG is that everything's built to last. So with this car they basically took what was an E320 avant-garde, they rebuilt the engine, they rebuilt the gearbox and the driveline. They put different suspension, different wheels and different brakes. It's even got a completely different diff. And, the, and being an AMG, everything is a lot stronger, so it's got a stronger gearbox, stronger diff to handle the power. And what that means is they generally last longer. They do more kilometres. If you go online, you'll see other E36s and E55s with 300, even 400,000 kilometres driving absolutely perfectly if you have driven them. Zircon silver really is a beautiful colour. The headlights are nice and clear. These are the f one of the first of the plastic headlights and they den did seem to lose their colour over time. It's even got the little AMG badge under the number plate there which generally over time has fallen off for whatever reason or it may have had paint and they haven't put it back on. But I just can't stop, stop looking at it. It's, it's absolutely gorgeous. It's got the very nice hammer alloy wheels. I think last time we sold it, we had a whole lot of people asking if they can just buy the wheels for their E320 or their S320 or whatever it is. And obviously we would never sell genuine AMG wheels by themselves. It's also got a body kit, as you can see. It's got a much more rigid body kit than the later E55 in 99-2000. They certainly rounded it off, and I think that really this body shape is much better, much more traditional. I think the lines just work beautifully. As I'm not walking around much, but even just panning over the car from this angle, it's just absolutely stunning. We'd better have a look at this logbook. It's been fully serviced, it's had the timing chain tensioners done. It may have even had a timing chain. I better have a look at this history. Yeah, so it had an oil service, coolant, water pump, timing chain tensioner. Before that, it had a service at 143,000 kilometres. 140,000 kilometres. Looks like 
at about 133,000 kilometres. It has front and rear um, drive shaft cufflings, front and rear brake pads and discs and flush, replaced drive belt. And then we'll just, I'll just quickly flick over because there's so many pages of servicing. And then it's all bends before that. Unbelievable. So if you, you are a collector and you want to buy one of these cars, you've really got to buy them with a good service history. People want to see that it's Australian delivered, you know, that's been serviced by Mercedes-Benz or a specialist. You're not going to get a lot of interest in a 20-year-old car if you've got no logbook or a logbook which hasn't been filled out properly. So it's a bit sunny at the front of the show, but looking down the side, you can see it's gun barrel straight. It's absolutely stunning. Well, thanks again for watching our video today. If you want to find out more about the Mercedes-Benz E36, you can look it up on Google. It'll tell you all the statistics, the performance, the power, and, um, and how many there really are around. But I think to buy a, what was a supercar, and in a lot of ways really is, for under $20,000, with absolute reliability, you really can't go past something like this. Thank you so much for watching our video today, and we look forward to hearing from you.